What a weekend. There was just a lot of things going on at the same time and a lot of events that wanted Louis to be part of. And that's always hard, just planning around his schedule. I think I had it all planned out nicely. Picked him up on Friday early, he was tired, didn't have a nap, put him early to bed, so he wakes up early the next day. We went on a hike in the morning to uh, Rose Valley just for him to get very, very tired and to nap. It's getting hot again and it wasn't hot for a long time. And last year everything was burning up at this time. So it's kind of nice that everything's still green all around. It's usually all dry and yellow and brown and I probably jinxed it now. One hundred and can we stand up for a bit? You just need to get something out of your chair, okay? Um because it is it. You're gonna sit, you're gonna sit, I promise. I just need one thing. And that's sunscreen. Sunscreen. Okay. Okay, there you go. I guess it. Sunscreen. Perfect. You're not hiding so good because I can see you. There's a bee. Then we went to the carnival. And that worked. I think he had a decent time. He was a bit too young still for these kind of things, but he'll get there. And that was all part of the plan, so he goes to bed late and he sleeps his regular, you know, 12-13 hours that he sleeps. And that didn't go according to plan. He went to bed around 9, woke up around 7, so that's 10 hours, which you would think it's good, but it's not really for a toddler. But the reason I wanted him to sleep longer is because there's a snowbird show, which is the Canadian Air Force, aviation, show, something. They fly in formations and all that. I've never seen it. And I thought Louis might want to see it, but I had a feeling he just wouldn't be interested in that. We met up with some friends. We went up Knox. That was around like 12, 1 p.m. He just didn't want to walk. It was hot. Fair play to him. It was hot. So I have to, have to carry him. And it's hard as you have a bag full of snacks and a camera. and. You have to walk uphill with a toddler. I think I have like one video of the um, airplanes. <laughs> or anger. But yeah, it was pretty cool. This whole weekend, I feel, was just so loud and and noisy, and that's why I appreciate nature like this. And this is 7 p.m. This is um, behind me is Goat's Peak. I didn't go all the way up, but yeah, it's nice. I can sit here for uh, hours. There's literally not a soul here. It's so quiet. You just collect your thoughts. I feel five percent more ready to go and do a work week. I really do appreciate being in a place like this where I can do these things. You know, when I dropped off Louis and I got home and I had dinner, it was either let's just, you know, drink beers on the patio until we pass out or I can come here, do a little walk, 
I wish I had a beer though. I'm not on a diet, but I'm trying to avoid drinking. I'm getting a little bit of a dad bod situation going on here, so. But uh, we are keeping that under control. See you on the next video.